Hey guys, I just got off work. It's New Year's Eve, and I don't even know what the heck we're doing tonight. Like, usually we have got, like 15 invitations, but this year we have zero. Like, at least none that I know of. Parents have been getting pretty bad about that, not telling me what's going on. So, yeah, I, it's just, it's kind of frustrating. <laughs> well, my friends invited me to do anything. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's really weird. So I have to go because I'm busy and stuff. Alright, bye. I can't hold this the tripod on it. Hey guys, so, uh, I don't I hate this. People are so inconsiderate. This kitchen counter was clean a minute ago. Now it's dirty, and now I have nowhere to put this pizza that I... I'm holding a camera and a pizza, nowhere to set the both. So I just I gotta hold them. Yeah. That is freaking great. Anyway, um... New Year's kind of sucks this year. <laughs> yeah, I guess that you guys are on right here. Uh, mostly because we're not doing anything. And mom and dad got invited to uh, go to a friend's house, an old friend. We didn't get invited to do nothing. We weren't even invited. So, so yeah. Mmm, cheese sticks. Got pizza here. We're pizza, and for some reason Jay wants to watch Jersey Shore. This is pretty funny, actually. So, yeah, this is good. Mm. Hey guys, so, oh that was a sex joke that she just made. Did you catch that? Get it fist pumped, and she's like, "Get ready, Vinny." <laughs> oh, that's funny. Um, we were just watching the thing on MTV, because I guess Charles Trippy is supposed to be in that studio that they're supposed to do with the Jersey Shore, and they're supposed to drop Snooki from a ball, right, yeah. at midnight, Yeah. but that ball is in Seaside Heights in New Jersey, and they're in Times Square right now, Snooki's in Times Square. I just noticed that. Uh, um, we ju we just you know, if you guys remember, Bobby Moynihan was doing a the, the sketch on S on SNL Weekend Update with Seth Ma with Seth Meyers where he played Snooky, and he's like, "You want to touch my poof?" And he's making orange jokes, and, and when Seth went to touch her poof, his poof, whatever, he's like, "He said, whoa, whoa, whoa!" I said, "Touch it, don't mash it." Well, Bobby Moynihan it was on a skit on MTV. It was the funniest thing I've ever seen in my life. It, like, it's like, finally, the fake Snooki got to meet. What is that cat doing? Let go! The cat wants, desperately wants in. She can't come in here with, like, doing that. Uh-uh. Um. Yeah. They're at the, they're, like, the guy's at the Jersey Shore with the ball that Snooki's supposed to go in and they're going to drop her from the ball at midnight. But Snooki's in Times Square. And with that traffic, I don't see how in the heck they're going to get her out of there. Anyway, um... I don't know. It was so funny, that sketch. Whoa, I'm just way off the charts right now. So funny, man. <laughs> yeah, so we're, it's just me and Dre here at the house, chilling out. Mom and Dad went to a party without us. Because we weren't invited by our own friends. <laughs> yeah, I'm in the dark now, so you can't see me. You know, I really think the only thing the reason that MTV is doing something like this is so that they can write bad jokes. <laughs> Basically, write bad jokes that they didn't get a chance to air earlier this year. <laughs> You know, they talk about um, BP, like, and they're saying like, 
The only thing that BP is going to clean up is Polly D's hair. <laughs> Get all that gel out of there. Like then she said, oh, that's not gel. Sorry, Polly D. That's Ronnie Seaman. Like, what? And she said that, like, on live TV. I'm like, what? You can't say stuff like that. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it was funny, but it's just a bad joke. <laughs> hey, guys, we have about two minutes left. And then, but by the time I get done saying this, there'll be two minutes left. So what's the point of saying that there's three minutes left? When there's clearly two minutes and nine, eight, seven, four, six, five, four, three... Two, one seconds left. There's two minutes till the ball drop. And one minute till the ball drop, actually. Sarah! Pancakes! Waffles! These waffles are mine! I put them on, got them from the freezer, and I put them on my plate. Ah! What am I sitting on? And it was a tripod. That's, uh, that's a lot of jokes. <laughs> tripod. <laughs> <laughs> you can sit on my tripod. <laughs> the ball drop, here we go. The ball's dropping, you can see it. I don't, I don't see why it takes, they take so long to drop it. Because if you drop it any faster, it'll break. That, those are crystals, Jay. Like this. It's little crystals like this. But why so Less than a minute till one 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 eleven. Wait, one well, why not one, start one, the 11. ball drop at twelve o'clock? Because it's the final thing of the year. Last thing we do of the new year is this. Okay. Ten seconds, nine. Eight, eight seven, six, five, four, three, two. One. Happy, Happy New, New Year! Year. <sighs> You're not supposed to down it. Should hold acquaintance be forgot and never brought to mind? Should all acquaintance be forgot? For all laying sign. For all laying sign, my dear. For all laying sign. We'll share a cup of kindness yet. For all laying sign. Happy New Year, everybody. Thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for following me and stalking me on the internet. Uh, and as weird as this sounds, I, I appreciate it. Uh, it's, it's really weird to put up a video and nobody respond to it. So, those who do, and the very few that do, thank you. Um, I love you guys. Hope you guys have best of luck this New Year, and best of luck with your New Year's resolutions. What? I don't think that was a firework. Price 2.0 at his daily YouTube video show. Just an average normal work.
working dude that'll never miss a day for you.